Good morning. Just looking for the right lighting here. The lighting will either make it or break it. Okay. So, um, this video is about kind of what I'm doing and then also a little bit about YouTube. Um, so I've gotten a lot of questions lately about what I'm doing, like, am I traveling? Am I in one place? Am I living in the van? Am I living in the Airstream? Um, obviously I'm in the Airstream right now. I'll actually show you, it's pretty cute. Bedroom. And then back there is the kitchen, living area, bathroom. Um, so the van's outside. Um, this Airstream I actually purchased from a guy about a year and a half ago. Um, and he was going to renovate it for me. It just took a lot longer than I anticipated. So um, in the process of that is whenever I purchased the van actually as a towing vehicle and renovated it with my dad and then went out to do the whole van life thing. Um, I think I traveled in the van for about three months before I got the email from the guy saying that the Airstream was ready. Um, so at that point I went to Tennessee and picked it up, brought it here to Albuquerque. Um, and I've been here for a couple weeks. You guys, this is my view. Sorry if the curtains are getting in the way. <laughs> it's just really pretty. Um, so yeah, I've been here a week. Um, I am still kind of adjusting, unpacking, uh, repainting, fixing things up a little bit. Um, my long-term goal is actually to rent this unit out on Airbnb as a vacation rental and to move back into the van. Um, that was not my intention in the beginning, but now that I've experienced van life, I just... I, I gotta go back to it. Like, the Airstream is wonderful, but I do not want to be towing this thing around all the time. And renting it on Airbnb could potentially um, be a great source of income to fund my travels. Um, I do have a loan on this Airstream and I'll be paying it off in the next several years, so that that's kind of a big reason why, why I'm here right now trying to figure this out. Um, I thought about selling it, I thought about, you know, just living in it consistently for a few years, but I really just want to get back on the road, so hopefully the Airbnb thing will work out. Um, I will be working throughout the summer as well. I have a friend that's opening up a restaurant here, and I'll be helping her out. Um, so it'll be interesting, like, living in the van and working at the same time. Um, if the Airstream doesn't rent out consistently, I'll probably stay here when it's not occupied. But otherwise, I will be in the van. Um, so, as far as YouTube, um, YouTube is not something I ever thought I would be doing. Um, <laughs> Side. Sorry. So in the beginning, I kind of actually had like this disdain for YouTube. Um, I had an ex who actually was obsessed with it, and every time we hung out, that was all he wanted to do. So it kind of drove me crazy. Um, but then also, I I met Camper Van Kevin um, at the RTR, and he did like this tour of my van and kind of like little interview thing um and then I met Brian who I traveled with for a month or so and hanging out with them and kind of like seeing what goes into it and whatnot I was like that's cool but you know it's not something I could ever do because you know I think that I sound funny I only look great from certain angles I I didn't want to put makeup on every day. Like, I don't normally look like this. <laughs> and then also, like, the criticism. I mean, 
there's a lot of amazing supportive people, but there's a lot of negativity too, and that's that's not always easy to ignore. Um, so it took a while for the idea to grow on me. Um, and the videos that I have up now, I kind of did as like an experiment. Um, I've been posting videos for about a month now. And I have been really surprised at, at the response. Like it's, it's been good. I have, I think like 2000 followers, which is way more than I thought I would have. And for the most part, people are, like, very encouraging and very supportive. So, thank you guys so much for that. Um, my hope is that throughout the summer, I'm able to save enough money to travel full-time again in the fall. Um, and if I can build some sort of following on YouTube, that could help tremendously. Um, like I said, I will be here consistently for the next few months, so I'm not sure like what sort of content I'm going to come up with. Um, but it will definitely be an Airstream tour, a van tour. Um, I'll get creative. It'll be good. So, so yeah, that's kind of my deal for now. Um... And then I also just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching and for being encouraging and for subscribing and yeah, just for coming along on this, this journey of mine. It's, it's been a bit tumultuous, but I mean, I think I'm happier than I've ever been. And, like, I have so much hope and joy and, like, it's just, it's really beautiful. And traveling is amazing and I'm, like, so thankful for the past few months and even for where I am now and for where I'm going to be. Um, like I'm not super looking forward to working again consistently, but I'm learning I'm learning to live every day present and the people that I'm meeting are amazing and so that it's definitely becoming like more important and more of a priority. So anyway, um, thank you guys for watching and please subscribe and yeah, we'll see you later. <laughs>